We got refined storage up and running. I haven't transferred everything fully over, but we haven't, like, we've started on this. I haven't finished it yet, though. That's what I'm going to be doing today. I did a little bit of off-camera work, not a ton. Um, I threw down the fourth wall with drawers. So I got this working here, and then I just moved the cable up. So I have a little bit of, like, spare space to move over a few things that wasn't just on this wall here. Because I'd like to get rid of simple storage almost entirely today. What is the raffle for? So at the moment, the raffle will enter you into this thing right here. I run down these a few times every stream. And if you win the raffle, then you get entered into the gladiator arena. Where you get a chance to fight me as like an NPC. There's a lot of gladiators at the moment because I haven't ran this in a while. Considering I've heard that they're going to be like making a new system. For everything so i'm kind of holding off from throwing any of you guys in until a new system comes out uh let's show the previous stuff mentions ravel once <laughs> all right patch notes quick patch note quick patch note quick patch notes patch note quick patch note balance update uh slightly increased knowledge essence in living chests increase knowledge essence Okay. Um, a question I want some, like, thing going to us. Lower the amount of magnetite ingots required for several magnet upgrades. I like this a lot. Lower the amount of vault plating needed for durability upgrading pickaxes. I also love this a lot. Heavy, heavily increase the amount of raw carbon found in wooden chests. God bless. Uh, added soul value to empty flasks. How much? Flasks are in here. 32. Okay. Reasonable. Reasonable amount. Small reasonable amount. Reduce the rate of the festive themes. I like that. Uh, loot information shift over does no longer display an identified Valkyr. Very good fix. Very good fix. Fix the Bogdan auxiliary blocks, making trapdoor street as air blocks. Wait. Auxiliary? Oh, auxiliary blocks mean trapdoor street. Oh, okay. It doesn't have anything to do with trapdoors and like another AI empathing. Fix the debug with black market. Oh. Uh, fix the bug displaying unknown for vault ore and bounties. And fix the mana shield ability to respect players' damage reduction. <gasps> mana shield fix! Oh! We build in some shit today! Alright, so step one. Step one is done. Step two involves uh, destruction. So I've got the priority on refined storage set up to where things will prioritize going into the drawers over anything else. Because um, the priority on here is zero, and the priority on the drawer machine is a thousand or 101, somewhere around those lines. Um, so I think what the game plan is, is to chuck some discs into here. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I forgot to disconnect the system down there. 4.2k to 32k. And that right there? That's nice. That, that is nice. A little bit more than a single 4K disc, and everything else is working off of drawers. Absolutely gorgeous. And nothing broken up here? Nothing broken at all. It's all in! Are we good? We're good! It's done! It's moved over! Simple storage is gone! We're fully digital! Fully digital, fully running off power from Kajirium. Thank you, Abe, for extending over some Blaze Spawn eggs from yesterday. We're good, baby. Welcome home, RS. I'm gonna be honest, this is kind of lame. I was thinking about filling the entire thing up with water. Because I'm pretty sure that all this works while submerged, right? And that way I'd be able to swim around to access my drawers. I think I might do that. That's good. How much is this? 
32 skill shards. Okay, okay, reasonable. Um, skill orb is what? Orb frame, black opal, extraordinary band sign, and essence. How much black opal do we have? 43 black opal. 5 essence and extraordinary Benny. Oh, oops. Uh, run me up with three of these for now. Oh, actually, I can do four. Perfect amount to make four. Incredible. Damn, okay. And then I could spec two levels out of ghost walks to bring us down to a three second duration if needed, which I think I'm actually comfortable with. I think I'm fine with that. Oh my days. Wait a minute. Oh my god. So 10 second cooldown, two second mana absorption, or two second per mana drain, and 60% absorb. The, ch the deal is once you get to three mana, or once you get to 7%, 70%. Level 7, it goes up to 3 mana per second. So in theory, this requires 300% to level out. So if we maxed out to 100, and it was 3 mana per second absorption, then we would only be able to regen mana to like a 33% degree. Which depending on how much mana gets burned every time you get hit with armor and resistance applying correctly, that could either be fine... Or it could be pretty detrimental. Like, we might, like, have a difficult time burning or, like, regenerating up mana. We have to disable mana shield to have it regen properly, which could definitely be the viable thing. Like, go into a room and activate mana shield. Once I'm done looting the last POI, disable mana shield, and then reactivate it again when I get to the next POI. That's viable as well. But I think I'm going to try out this first. Where's my control for... Some usability mana shield. I've got G as my maybe H. I think H is actually pretty good. So hold on. 146 on the bottom there. Oh my god. Well, sum it down, see the new values are, yeah? Here. What you got for me? Hmm. So about the, uh... Okay, things still hurt. Mana's looking really good, though. Oh, yeah, you would give me an Omega item off of that in the first... Okay, dude. Alright. Good for ma Black Mob Essence, I suppose. Spires are supposed to drop it, so... I don't even know if I had any damage. I definitely did. Major Canadian! The Bogdan Canadian! We got nine. Yeah, 11. All right. Nice uh, pit sub, actually. Nice room. I'll take it. Woo! Dude, I am burning down my armor. <laughs> Taking so much fucking damage from everything. Good for testing the uh, mana shield, I suppose. I'm brute forcing this shit. Mana shield, take me home.
creeper was getting pushed by the faster, uh... Vault Dweller? <laughs> so the creeper was like fucking running, dude. That's hilarious. Oh! Calm it down. Worth noting as well that my, uh... Have you guys been keeping track as to how much, like, my, uh... How much mana I've been losing per hit? Because it's actually looking like it's pretty... Like, a pretty reasonable amount per hit. What levels are shield level? 60% absorption. That's a big dude. Pump that mob cap up. Holy fuck. All right, man shield's going down a little bit now. Man shield's going down a little bit from that. Oh yeah, I didn't fill my inventory. Head ass behavior. Oh, I was ill-prepared for this vault, man. Woo! Get me out of here! Later, bitch! Don't know if that was possible with, uh, just running around every room and looking at every POI we could find. That one was, uh... That one was, uh, not very ideal. 30,000 damage dealt. Holy shit. I should know the number I was looking at was 488 received. Did he die? What? Mm mm. Mm mm. Wow, West. How much bronze? 1600 bronze, 15 vault silver. Pretty alright if I do say so myself. 125 soul shards. Pretty okay. Pretty alright. That was incredible. I was taking 60% less damage that entire vault than I normally would have. Every hit would have been more than double the amount of damage that I was getting dealt. That was really, really good. Held up well in the dragon room, held up well in any POI that I went into, and even with like what felt like standard healing, like at, until I got into the dragon room and I was just bursting down heels like crazy, like nobody's business. That was really, really good. I think it's time to do a little max level test now. Here. Scav, kill a boss, monolith. What you got for me? Scav! Trapped in chunky mobs. All right. Need a jar. And two spider soul charms. This could help. Do I need a jar? Yeah, I do. Nice. Jar. Might as well just snag some loot while I'm here.
Lose a little pickaxe durability for the fun of it, you know what I'm saying? Hmm. I want to talk about it. I want to talk about it. What's up with me, man? What's happening to me? Not running enough vaults. I've been doing too much base work. Losing my touch. Losing my touch, man. How much durability? Went down 130 durability in that one. Uh, crate would have been trash anyway. No, but it wouldn't have been is the thing. Vendor room. Love in common. Vendor and a crystal. 76 soul shards and some scab stuff to dump down as well, too. Ooh, wee. <laughs> oh, I've been getting way too many of these bad boys. All right. Worst case scenario, it's a trinket scrap and we can make another phylactery out of it. No loss here. Oh, quantity. That, that's a big one right there. That's the spicy, that's the spicy one. That is, that's the really good one. Apparently there's a bug currently where people aren't getting treasure loot. So, you know, 25% to zero. But if we ever want to run out some treasure chests, that's the one right there. That's the one right there. That's the new trinket. We take that one home. Huge. Huge. Only 13 use, though. I mean, you use this on, like, special runs. You know what I mean? So 13 uses, yeah, it kind of sucks. But it's not like a file where I'm going to be running multiple vaults with this all the time. This is a, you know, special use case. So it's going to last for a while. Oh, I love it. I love how it looks. So, so nice. What's the cost to you? What do you take to craft? Two pogs, 32 vault diamond, two vault platinum, 12 extraordinary elections, right? One trinket scrap. Point the swords at me right now. That seems a little cheap, to be honest. Now you can always craft it, so long as I have the materials for it. The trinket scrap and all that kind of thing. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. Rustic? Could be used with a goose? No, it's a uh, trinket. Goose is also a trinket, so it's item quantity or rarity. You gotta pick whether you want 50% item rarity or 25% item quantity. And I think I would take item quantity every day of the week. Item rarity is good, don't get me wrong, but item quantity at 25%, even though it's half the value, it's still like that's... For the time being, I'm getting out of 100% mana shield. I'm going back to 60%. Two minute per second, that's great. Love that. 60% additional defense, fantastic. You want to know who's a big fan of that? It's this guy right here. I'm a pretty big fan of that one. I like that a uh, good amount. Getting heal back up to nine, and I'm probably throwing one more level into two for this one. Yes, two. That one. I feel like it'd almost be worth it to get rid of one level of Ghost Walk for right now. May throw us back into strength. Not been dealing as much damage to mobs as I would like. Just finding that to be a rather big problem um, during the last vaults. I think it's a good reallocation of our points for right now. Yeah. Scav? Four monolith. I'm sleep, bro. I guess I'm here for Laramar, nothing else, so. Oh, well. That'll do it. I 
Got to find one per vault. That's the that's the agreement. That's the agreement. That just ain't right. That just ain't right. X mark room number two. Someone's got to check the config for the main. So, someone's got to do it. It ain't going to be me, but so, someone's got to do it. Messed up there. Ooh, painting room. How many of these we got? We got a few. By 48 Echo? I don't know, probably because it's considered one of the better ones. I'm not really sure their reasoning for some archetypes costing more than others. Oh my god, it's a lot, actually. Brute AI looking ass. This is the most cut and dry, like, hanging buckets I've ever had in my life. Oh. I thought it was indented, so I could just bank it off that wall and be fine. Double rock. <laughs> This vault so quickly and chill. How have you been liking uh, Volner? You're still doing the Let's Play for your YouTube channel, right? And then the bread is so if I drink a potion of healing and then drop it, it'll go right into here and not somewhere in my inventory. What does Double Rotten do that a single one doesn't? Be twice as effective, clearly. Pretty all around good vault. Got a lot of gear from just a few ornates during that. I'm trying to look at some of the loot table values, even though we were mostly running around. We weren't looting like too many regular chests. Three key pieces. 174 raw carbon. Okay. And a lot of vault stone. Some of the things that they tweak. So it's four skill essence. I like that. 16 vault diamonds. Feels like we get a lot of vault diamonds. 30 Vault Essence, 48 Magnetite, 6 Silver Vault Dust, 35 Knowledge Essence. Knowledge Essence is found in completion crates living in wooden. Finding most of the knowledge I think in living crates. And we got a 41% loot efficiency and 79% experience efficiency. Alright, let's get to level 50, shall we? Here. Time vault we got. It's just the case every time. It's just the case every time, you know. Number one. Chandeliers look really cool. Actually, kind of insane that it's a scout as well, too, because now we get some soul shards from us. Pretty cool. 
That reach every time? I know. <laughs> Never gets old. What was that? Loving shots down here is kind of killing my vibe, dude. It's a lot of spiders. Let's eliminate some of you, please. Calm down. Climbing over that, are you? I think I've gotten a false sense of how fast I can kill mobs in here and do this, like clear it out from killing, because I don't have uh, the damage that I did before. I guess that only really affects the spiders. So I'm down from strength two to strength one. Fuck her off there, bud. Man, it's a little bit of the low side. You gotta just continue drinking health pots instead of healing. Do the ability. I don't have nearly the amount of mana regen for... ...regaining mana as I did with my idol. Loop in the route. Come on, man. Room one cleared. Perfect. Room number two. Room number two. 
Uh, that's good. Messed up. I've had cleaner routing before, I'll be honest. Just, uh, really not ideal. Not ideal. Way too high for this. Way too high for this. Mobs are all around me. This is, uh, fucked up. This is really fucked up. I want to test something. wondering like how easily doable that was and uh found the answer that simplifies things a little bit now doesn't it Wow, that's a lot of spiders. I, mean, I guess it's the entire concentration of them. Slime off that as well, too? Damn, that'll help with the uh, mob cap. Oh, dude, just doesn't want to die. It's rather uh, quiet in here. I don't know if you guys feel the uh, same way.
Not a fan of you spawning. Gotta get that last bit. Not leave with a cast on the ground. On my house. Come here. Bugger off. Man. Let me alone. Leave me alone! I'll let him out! That's number three! Fortunate find. All right, let's try doing this again, but a little bit more deliberately. Here's the idea that I have. Right, okay. Uh, could do better with a 3x3. Three 3x3 three. Three three literally solves the issue. Get in the hole, you fat sons of bitches! Did actually get pretty lucky with all the vault doors getting in there. And by all the vault doors, I mean two of them. <laughs> the, the, the two vault dwellers. Drink of this, get ready for the onslaught. Here they come. What? Oh, I'm keeping you. Oh, you are, uh, I'm not killing you. 
You are staying alive. Just got a, I uh, got a soft spot for you. Not for that guy. Not for that guy though. Not for you. Not trying to get any of you killed. Don't want to respawn any spiders. Or vault dwellers. Woo! Probably the fastest clear I think I've had. Let's get the hell out of here, yeah? That'll do it. A bad run at all that was actually incredibly smooth all things considered all right believers i got you i got you there's in our coin piles not level 50 yet actually god bless one living did not break a single one though I have 73 damage taken, 9600 damage dealt. Okay, yeah, so they, uh... Clogging up all the mobs that are currently in there so they can't spawn above the cap. Pretty good! Yeah, no, but for real. Appreciate you guys a lot, thank you for everything. Uh, thanks for always making the streams very hospitable and welcoming and such. Hopefully I do the same. I will be on tomorrow with more ball hunters and all that kind of stuff. But until then, I appreciate y'all. Hope y'all have a wonderful night. Keep safe and all those kinds of things. And uh, yeah, I appreciate you guys. Thanks for watching.